Welcome back to Gooderman! I haven't fucking touched this game since last time. Sorry. I know I said I was gonna, like, maybe go back. Have I even... I guess I, I did get Master Rank. What did I say I was gonna do last time? I don't remember. But I, I know I'm missing, like, a Master level somewhere. But, uh... Oh, yep, there it is. I, I didn't get... Ma I didn't replay this level off camera. It's the only thing I didn't do. Anyway, it's a new day, it's a new week. I gotta fucking get some videos out, because I got, like, other shit to do. Um, uh, let's go to the next part of Radish Woods. Actually, hold on, do I have, like, anything new? Nope, got the, still got the, I got a mystery bag, I can go turn that in. Fuck it! Let's do a new level. Radish Woods, Serpent Road, what are the other levels called? Forest Ballroom, Eerie Way, Clear, Cheery Forest Path, and Fountain Clearing. What a... Alright, so we're back with Guru Man. Haven't played in a week. So it might take me a second to get used to shit. Does this level? It does, doesn't it? It has like a weird gate guarding the place. Light all the torches! Oh shit! Actually, how do I light the torches? I can't light these torches, they're, they're destructible. As soon as I touch them, they'll burn. Or they'll just be destroyed. Huh. Is there a way to light the torches without destroying them? You fool! Don't destroy them! Return later! Gosh dang it! Fucky shit! Yeah, leave. Alright, so I obviously have to use fire. Of some kind. And I have my fire parts. Light all the torches. How do I light them without destroying them? Huh. Jump? Okay, nope, that doesn't fucking work. Shit! Don't destroy the torch. How do I do this? Damn it, this is not how I wanted to start the recording session with something like this. Are we gonna do a different level because I can't light all these torches? Alright. Uh, you wish you pass, light all the torches. Alright, I have an idea. I have a really stupid idea. Let's see if, uh, Dragon Force! Okay, okay, that does work. That lights them without destroying them. Ha! Yeah, look at that shit. Dragon Force! Dragon Drop Kick! Okay. Don't destroy them. Okay, almost destroyed that one. I don't know what the range is for my destruction! Ha! That had to- How does that- mm. Alright. I just have to like, aim. And shoot! Yeah. Okay. All torches lit. You may pass. Into the hell forest you go, Perrin. Ah. What do we got? What's the ribbon do again? Immune to trap effects. Fuck that. Where's my... Where's my magic hood? Yeah! Best thing in the game, because it gives extra damage. Woo! Nice! Alright. Dude, for real. Like, this game is throwing more and more... Phantoms with like the Don Creek porcupine armor on all the time. I can't, can't even cut through that shit with my drill. I gotta use charge attacks. All right. Ah, does this have different music than the rest of the forest? I'm going to find out. I have to. Nope. Nope. Okay. Yeah. Whatever. I'll review the footage later and see if this does have different music. Ah. Oh no. Water. I see. Oh, I know. That's not water on the. Oh, the mini map. Messing with me. I think that the water is like right here, but no, it's just different elevations. Cool! Whatever. Yay! Maximum drill! Ah, shit. Here's water. Okay, there is water. Goggles! Go! Yeah! I've learned that sometimes there are things hidden in the water! Ooh, wait. I can use my uh, electric parts and just destroy. Ah, oh, shit. I can't change in the water. Alright. Rising Thunder Dragon Force! Yeah! Oh, yeah, I can shock everything that's in the water. If I do like a special attack. That makes killing all these enemies much easier. Where is that? Oh, it's still alive. Oh, it's like a giant cat. It's like a big old loach. Come on! There we go. He must have had more health. Yeah, I can sink to the bottom of bodies of water. And sometimes there will be like hidden passages down there. I've certainly noticed it when I was uh, 
collecting all the pots from uh, uh, spinach caverns. Is that what it's called? Hey, a quick way over. Nice. And secret thing back here. Ah, oh, hey, you don't think I don't see all that junk and this wall, which contains nothing? Never mind. All right. Cool. Whatever. Where do I go? Like, what's the correct way to go? If this is anything like the second half of Potato Ruins, this is just gonna be like the same level played in reverse. And it is starting to look like that. I've recognized this whole area. Yeah, I recognize this area faintly. So, what the hell? Is that what all these bonus levels are? Just like backwards, harder versions of the previous parts? Well, fine! I can dig it! Homing attack! Wow, that was easy. Is that for, like, somebody who doesn't have the goggles? Alright. And the way is open! Ah, oh, picture plants of doom. Damn it. Alright. Let me give a little check a road to the surrounding area. There might be some hidden bullshit. Although I don't remember there being anything hidden in this lake on the regular levels of Turnip Woods. Fuck it, let's go. Dun, 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 dun. I can just latch on. No, oh, the other way. Yeah. Beautiful. Hello, pitcher plants. You're dead. Ah, you're shooting seeds. Kill them. Ah. So what do I get for uh, beating all these like harder levels? Wait, back to cat ears, cause I gotta keep an eye out for hidden shit. Or pots. And shit like that. Dragon Force! God, I love this dragon attack. Is that what it's called? I hope I'm not like fucking up the name. Spinning Dance, last page, Dragon Flame. That's what it's called. I've been calling it Dragon Force. Don't know where I got that from. Huh. Hell, it's not even flame anymore, because I'm using lightning effects. God, it's got a wide range of attack. Fuck the world! The ultimate attack! God! And there are no more attacks to learn with drill upgrades, so that is like the ultimate attack. It's gonna be like the thing I use for the rest of the game. Boss fights will be a breeze. Ah. Maybe there's like a battle arena or some shit. Oh! Oh, big guy! Big phantom! Thought you could ambush me with your. Oh no! Wow. These two. But they've got the Don Creed porcupine armor. So they're. Uh, I gotta take it off. Uh, forward! Damn it! No! Did you ruin my dragon force? No, you didn't. Yeah, I lowered your frame rate, motherfucker! Damn it! Fuck! No, my drill! I'm down to pretty missile kick. Whatever, do it. Uh, pretty missing. <laughs> God, I love this game. Ah, oh, it makes me feel good. Drilling, destroying enemies, finding treasure. I gotta say, this game has definitely surprised me. I did not think it would be this hardcore action. You, you would definitely like. Uh, you would definitely misjudge this game based on the cover art. Cause like I thought this was gonna be like some. Very, very childish, easy, let's count to the number 10 type game, you know? It's like, press X here to win! But no, this is, this is difficult. Like, there's like combat and shit, and puzzles to solve, and... Ah, it's amazing. I love it. I'm, I'm, I'm glad that Spencer gave me this game, even though he himself thought it was like a joke of a game. Oh shit, I'm gonna be in the water, aren't I? Oh, I know, this is, this is alright. No! Oh! How do I... Come on! I can't fucking spin the stick fast enough! Fuck! Come on! There we go, pretty missile. I can't break all these! Got it, okay. That's all the pots, right? Whatever, I'll take the damage. Oh, actually, I, I, may, I, I can't really afford to take damage like I did in the earlier levels. These levels are getting harder, man! can't just willy-nilly throw my health away like I used to. It's like, oh, whatever, I'll, I'll go buy a cookie. 
Which, by the way, I still have no idea how to resolve the whole 5,000 coins for a piece of cake thing. Hopefully that is something that will be resolved later. I beat Cream! Can I, like, make her pay for the cakes? Can I clear my good name with the people of, uh, Transtown? Oh, shit. Yeah. Alright, so that opened up. But is that the correct way? Is that where I want to go? I can't even put out this fire. I really hope this is the right way to go. This place branches off, uh, in the regular stage. So in the backwards, the harder stage, I'm sure. Hey! Pink pumpkins! Lovely! We're all dead! Spin dance! Oh yeah, the spinning dance of doom! Oh, cool power oil. I love it. Honestly, I don't even need to buy much, because uh, these levels are providing all the power oils and confectionery that I need. I don't even need to, like, look at that, yeah, like, I got, like, maximum chocolate. I have, n I have not bought a piece of chocolate forever. Ah, this game provides me for everything I need. Okay, we got a sign here, probably from Motoro. This one's a mistaken path, yours M, so this is the wrong path. Well, that's actually a good thing, Motoro, because I like taking the wrong path first. That's my rule of thumb for these RPG-type games. You take the wrong path first, so you can get the treasure, and then you go back to the right path. It's just that in this case, treasure is pots. And maybe, like, scrap. Oh yeah, look at that, dead end. But I got the pot, see? That's good. I wouldn't have been able to get that pot if I went the correct way. So fuck you, Motoro! Oh, I can't destroy the sign? Fine, whatever. Alright, well, we gotta go all the way back. I wish there was a faster way. Why isn't there a cap that increases movement speed? So I can just, like, zippity zooda all my way through these levels. That would be- that'd be pretty cool. Then I would, like, immediately stop giving a shit about S-Rank. Like, immediately. Because I would just, like, put on the, the bunny ears, or whatever the fuck it would be, just blast my way through these levels, and then come back off-screen and do, like, the S-Rank shit. Yeah. Speed running, go! Yeah. All right. Uh, enemies. I see. Yeah. Okay. Cool. So the tree enemies do ah, show up on my radar. At least. Good for them. They can't trick me like that. Okay. Fire parts go. Magic hood go. And have a piece of chocolate. Fucking pretty missile. Yeah. Spin dance. <laughs> You're dead. You're fucking dead, all of you. I don't care about the trees, especially when they're trying to kill me. Oh, sweet! Now I can do Dragon Force again. Yeah, Dragon! Dragon Flame! <sighs> right off. Uh, keep an eye out for cracks in the wall. Ah, oh, Gilly Suit Phantoms! No! Oh, they're everywhere! Wait a minute. Can't I, like, get through this? Oh, no, that's the incur- Maybe if I kill all these ghillie suits- They got porcupine armor, too! Jesus, stop with the fucking porcupine armor! Shit! It's like the best phantom armor in the game. It's like, no matter what other bullshit they have, I can still, like, cut through it. But if they've got this porcupine armor, they're invincible. Just, that's- that's the it. It's just, like, the ultimate thing. Uh, final boss is probably just gonna be like covered in porcupine armor. Right, smash, smash. I feel like there might be a way to open this. Maybe there'd be like pots back there. But whatever. If I don't get S rank, we'll just uh just deal with it. You know, come back later. At least I'll have more positive energy from the furniture I get from this level. Oh, what do I get? It's a bookshelf. Anything else around here? Nope. Okay, let's see if I get S rank. Got a bookshelf! Also, tons of money. Yeah, I missed some enemies. Okay. I missed some enemies. Where could there have been enemies? Maybe some more fish that I missed or something? Huh. Okay. Well, let's go see who this uh, bookshelf belongs to. So we can uh, get to the next part of the Eerie Woods. My bets are on Rocco. He looks like a guy who reads. Ha <laughs> ha! Hey, Rocco! Uh, nope, okay. Chucky, do you read? 
find Pino? She, uh, sorry, Pino got kidnapped, didn't she? Shit, I gotta take care of that. You're always- yeah, you got- this guy loves music and literature? Heavy stuff. Get the bookshelf. Whatever. Hey, bookshelf. Achievement unlocked. Positive book energy! You did it! Now I can read! 